Hi angels, I hope you're all doing well today. So in today's video we are doing a huge Winners and Marshalls haul. I've been promising this for a really long time now. I've been saving up the items that I buy each week during my Winners Wednesday videos so I could show them all to you in one big haul. So if you want to see everything I picked up lately from Winners and Marshalls, just keep watching. Before we jump into this video, make sure you hit that big red subscribe button down below. It is completely free and I'd love to have you as part of our YouTube family. Also give this video a big thumbs up if you love haul videos and also hit that bell notification next to the subscribe button. That way YouTube will notify you every time I upload. Now this bag is so big, I really don't think it's even going to fit in the frame. So I have been saving up my items from my Winners Wednesday shopping trips where I take you shopping with me at my local Winners and Marshalls. If you haven't watched those, I will leave some of them linked in the iCards. That way you can go binge watch them if you want to. And I've been saving up the items that I purchased during those shopping trips to do one big haul with you. We found a ton of amazing items. Now I know a lot of provinces are locked down right now and this is in no way to rub it in your face that I can still go to Winners and Marshalls, but it does give you an idea of what is in store or what may be coming to your stores so that you know exactly what you're on the lookout for when your stores reopen. And I really hope that the lockdowns end soon. As you saw, this bag is completely full. We have a lot to get through. Let's go ahead and get started. Most of the items are from Winners, but a few of them are from Marshalls. So I'm gonna show you the Marshalls items first and then we'll get into the Winners haul. First thing I have is this charge and sync cable for my iPhone. Just thought the color was really pretty. This was actually on clearance for $13. I can always use more charging cords, so thought I would pick this up. Also found these cute little acid wash biker shorts. They fit me perfectly. They were only $12.99. Winners and Marshalls have a ton of really cute spring and summer clothes right now. And I just thought these were so cute, great for summer. These are from the brand Livy. I've never heard of that brand before, but these are a size small. And again, such a good deal at $12.99. Now for the items from the Marshalls Beauty section, I found this Creme Shop Melt Away 3-in-1 Cleansing Balm. Now I haven't heard anyone talk about the Creme Shop Cleansing Balm, but thought I might as well pick it up. It was only $6.99 at Marshall, so I thought I might as well pick it up. I go through cleansing bombs like crazy. If you guys have been watching me for a while, you know I'm constantly showing cleansing bombs in my empties videos. Some of my favorites are the Oak Cleansing Bomb from the Inky List and the First Day Dissolve Cleansing Bomb. Both of those are amazing. Also, the Holy Hydration Cleansing Bomb from e.l.f. I just love cleansing bombs, and there are definitely some that are better than others, and I love to try new ones. Pretty, pretty blue packaging. So the packaging's very similar to the Versed Day Dissolve Cleansing Balm, a little jar here. Comes with a little scooper as well, which is handy. Doesn't really have much of a scent to it, which is usually a good thing. I don't like a lot of fragrance in my skincare, so that I think will work out well. I will have to keep you posted. If, if there are certain items in this video you want me to review first and you want my opinion on, make sure you let me know in the comments down below. I picked up two makeup items from Marshalls. The first one is the Extra Dimension Skin Finish from MAC. This was only $14.99. Now I think these are usually about $30 or $35, so that's a pretty good deal. It's about 50% off. And this is in the shade Double Gleam. It looked like a really pretty champagne color. And then I also picked up this NYX Ombre Blush. This was $5.99. And this is in the shade Sweet Spring. I'm going to open this up and show you what it looks like inside. This is what the outside packaging looks like. Very beautiful. Looks like it has a little bit of a sheen to it. Definitely a hot pink kind of fuchsia color. I think that'll be really pretty for spring and summer. Now I have been talking about doing a testing makeup for Marshalls and Winners video for a while and I promise I am definitely going to do that so make sure you let me know if you want any of these items included in that video. Now we're moving on to our Winners purchases. I have a lot more from Winners. From Winners, I found these BH Cosmetics lashes. So these are the It's Magic Wink Wink Silk False Eyelashes. And I picked up two different styles. So this one here, does it say the names of them? So I can't find the names of these, but I'll just show you what they look like. And they were only $4.99 each. So there's the first pair, and then the second pair here that are more of a crisscross pattern. 
Another set of lashes I picked up are these from Pro Beauty Essentials. These are the 3D Foam Ink Lashes for $6.99. I think one pair is a little bit longer than the other. I don't think they're the exact same, but they looked really beautiful and wispy. And for $6.99 for two pairs, I thought I might as well give them a try. We've been seeing a lot of these Sephora collection brushes at Winners and Marshalls, and this was one I actually hadn't seen before. This is the Precision Powder Brush, and this was $14.99. Now, I know Sephora recently redid all their brushes, and that's why we're seeing a lot of them at Marshalls and Winners. So this is what that brush is looking like there. It looks like a really nice powder brush. I was thinking it would be a little bit fluffier, but I think this would be really nice for setting your face with powder. Now yet another pair of lashes. These are our Dell Faux Mink Lashes for $5.99. Again, I'm sure you can tell the type of lashes I go for. Very wispy. I was really excited to find this NARS oil infused lip tint. This was $9.99 and I've heard a lot of people rave about these oil infused lip tints. I think Jamie Page really likes them and this one is in the shade Reef which is a really gorgeous bronzy color. And that was only $9.99 and I think full price are usually about $30 at Sephora. Now I'm going to show you the skincare I picked up. The first thing is from Pacifica. This is the Coconut Essence Hydro Mist for your face. Now it says party then rehab now. So it's supposed to be a rehab spray for your face. It actually smells really good. If you like coconut, you will love the smell of this. This is only $7.99 and I actually haven't tried a lot from Pacifica. So I've been seeing them more and more at Winners and Marshalls. So thought I would pick this up to try. Now it is pretty heavily fragranced in coconut. I think you could actually probably use that as a body mist as well. But if you like the smell of coconut, it's a really nice refreshing mist on the face. Another skincare item is this Vital Beauty Whipped Moisturizer. Now I've never tried anything from this brand Vital Beauty, but I thought the whipped moisturizer texture and the fact that it has hyaluronic acid really appealed to me. This was only $9.99, comes in this beautiful glass jar. Let's look at, okay, so it doesn't have a scent, but definitely has that whipped, kind of looks like jelly-ish texture. Excited to give that a try. This is something I really didn't need, but once I smelled it, I really wanted to have it. This is the Hawaiian Tropic Golden Paradise Fragrance Mist. Now this smells like summer in a bottle. This was $9.99 and the scent is warm sand and creamy coconut. And they had a few different scents. As you can tell, I do like coconut since the other one was coconut and this one's coconut. I love the smell of coconut. Reminds me of summer, reminds me of the beach. So I did pick this one up. And like I said, they had a bunch of different scents. I found another makeup item. This is from Buxom. This is their full on plumping lip creams and I really love Buxom lip products. I usually have really good luck with them. This one is in the shade Mudslide. And I actually had, I believe a mini in this shade and really loved it. So I'm excited to have this full size. This was only $7.99 and they had quite a few Buxom products at Winners including Buxom mascaras as well. Winners and Marshalls are also completely stocked with sunscreens right now. I will say just make sure you check the expiry date before you purchase any of them just to make sure you have enough time to use it up before it expires. This one does expire October 2021 so I'll use it this summer and that'll be totally fine. This is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel Sunscreen. I've never tried this sunscreen before but I know a lot of people love the Hydra Boost line. So this was only $7.99 for this one. For hair care, I picked up this Lucetta. I'm not sure how to pronounce the brand name. Let me know in the comments how to pronounce it. I think it's Lucetta, Luceta. This is the Biotin and Collagen Strengthening Oil Treatment. This was $7.99. I've heard great things about this hair care brand. I'm pretty sure they're sulfate free. So this contains a vitamin B7 biotin, Collagen and argan oil sounded like a really great hair treatment. I have very dry hair So I'm always looking for hair oils and hair treatments and masks to help hydrate my hair So this says for thin and dry hair again comes in a glass bottle. This is a long video This is probably one of the longest videos I've done in a while and I still have more so hang in there with me I hope you are enjoying this haul so far 
Now, if you follow me on TikTok, one winner's location I went to had so much clearance, I couldn't believe it. They had basically a whole wall filled with clearance items, and I just stood there for probably 15 or 20 minutes going through everything because it was kind of ransacked and you had to look really closely to find items. They were kind of piled on top of each other, but there was so much hiding in that clearance section. It was the clearance jackpot. And then other winners I go to, they don't have much clearance, so it really just depends on the location. So I'm going to show you some of the clearance items I found in that section. This is a pack of three spray hand sanitizers for only $3, so a dollar each. Thought that was a great deal. Can always use more hand sanitizers, especially right now. And these are unscented hand sanitizers. Also in the clearance section, this detox bath soak. If you know me, you know I swear by baths. I take baths almost every single day. So if there's a bath product that I haven't tried and it's a good price, I'm gonna pick it up. So this was only $7 down from $9.99 excited to give this a try. So it contains Epsom salt, Himalayan pink salt, calendula, rosemary, ginger, essential oils, lemon, sandalwood, probably going to smell amazing. I was so excited to find this. This is an electric callus remover. I've seen a lot of people talk about these in their Amazon favorites videos, and I think they're about $30 on Amazon, and I've been going back and forth about picking one up. I hadn't ordered one yet off Amazon, and then I found this one in the winner's clearance section for only $11 from the brand Zoe Alia. And I haven't tried this yet, as you can see, but a great thing to have for the summer. Really hoping it works well. We'll keep you posted. Another clearance item I found is this sugar-coated underarm hair removal kit. So this is vegan sugar wax. Now I'm sure you don't have to use it just for underarms. I feel like you could use it for your legs as well. But this was $7. And again, great for the summer to have this waxing kit. So I only have one home item to show you, and this is this beautiful candle from DW Home. This actually looks a lot like the brand new Forever Mood candles that Jackie Ina is releasing. I just thought the jar was so gorgeous, and I will definitely be reusing this jar after the candle is finished. This one was $14.99. If you're looking for candles, definitely check Winners Marshall's Home Sense. They have so many different kinds. I spend a really long time in the candle section just smelling them and finding ones that I love. So this is scented in fresh spring breeze. It's a really light scent, but again, I really just wanted the jar. It is a nice scent, don't get me wrong, but the jar is really what sold me and I'll probably use this for makeup brushes after the candle is done. And the last item is a jewelry item. This is from Rachel Zoe. So this is a really cute little gold bracelet set from Rachel Zoe. It was $19.99. And as you can see, it has this really cute J charm. As soon as I saw that there was a J, I was sold. I'm just such a sucker for anything with a letter or my initials. Thought these were really cute, can wear them with a lot, can layer them, absolutely love them. Gold jewelry is my favorite, as I'm sure you can tell. Okay, my loves, if you are still here, Thank you for watching until the end. I really hope you enjoyed this huge Winners and Marshalls haul. Definitely let me know in the comments which items were your favorite or which items you are planning to pick up at your local Winners and Marshalls. As always, thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.